Hello everyone, and welcome to my young and restless gossip channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Will Jack's stunt to save Nikki come between him and Diane? Nate reconnects with his old partner in crime and tells Audra, I thought we were buddies, Audra. And that's what friends do, tell each other the truth. Audra inquires, are you sure that's all it is, Nate? What information would Nate be looking for right now? Is he looking for another career change? Nate questions Audra YR. Lily asks Mamie at Chancellor Winters, what is this meeting about? Mamie tells her she'd rather wait till everyone has come. She promises it'll be worthwhile. What will Billy and Jill think of whatever Mamie has planned? Could she be preparing to remove them? Mamie has a surprise YR. A.D. After successfully rescuing Claire, Cole and Victoria assumed Jordan had left their life, unaware that Victor had her alive and in a cell in his basement. Next week, Victor will ask Cole, how is your relationship with Victoria? Has anything changed? Everyone wants to know the answer to that question. After failing to contact Nikki, who had gone on her biggest bender yet, Jack decided to join her. He called his old dealer, overdosed on pills, and nearly died. However, it was enough to scare Nikki straight, and she consented to attend rehab. Diane comes up and yells at Jack, you've thrown away years of sobriety, for Nikki Newman. Jack argues, my sobriety is not jeopardized. Diane responds, how do I know you don't have pills on you right now? Jack frowns. Could this be the start of the end for Jack and Diane? Victoria's grand gesture, to Claire, asks daughter to adopt Newman name? According to the young and the restless, YNR, spoilers, Claire Grace, Haley Aaron, is still in trouble as a result of Jordan's, Colleen Zank, schemes, but Victoria Newman, Amelia Heinley, and Cole Howard, Cole Howard, would go to any length to save their daughter. When Cole and Victoria ultimately rescue Claire, they will have to worry about her mental health in the aftermath. Claire may experience setbacks as a result of everything she has been through, but she will have lots of help to get back on track. It's a good indicator that Claire called Victoria and attempted to notify her mother that she needed assistance. That seems Claire was confident Victoria would find a way to help her. Claire will heal from her ordeal and perhaps resume her life with the Newmans once Victoria and Cole get to her aid. Fans of YNR will recall Claire's delight at finally having her own room at the Tack House and feeling like she had a genuine home. Despite Summer Newman's, Allison Lanier, recent rants over Claire, Claire has received a lot of support from the rest of her family. Victor Newman, Eric Braden, and Nikki Newman, Melody Thomas Scott, have fully accepted Claire as their grandchild, much as Victoria and Cole have done for their daughter. Of course, there is one thing that could make Claire feel even more like a real Newman. Victoria may eventually make a great gesture and get all of the paperwork for a name change completed. Claire was born Eve Howard and raised as Claire Grace, but what will her name be going forward? It's easy to envision Victoria and Victor asking her if she wants to be Claire Newman. Cole appears, content to have Claire in his life and should be comfortable with whatever she decides. Cole would undoubtedly be thrilled if Claire's new last name included his own, but he could understand if she simply decided to use the Newman name instead. Claire may, however, honor both Victoria and Cole by adopting the name Claire Newman Howard. Regardless, Victoria may attempt to ensure Claire that she is a genuine Newman deserving of bearing that name and becoming a part of their family history. According to the young and the restless spoilers, Claire may change her identity soon, so we'll keep you updated on what to expect, including any name changes. Jack's pill-popping emergency lands, Kyle as Jabot's co-CEO, drama erupts. According to spoilers for the young and the restless, YNR, Kyle Abbott, Michael Mueller, has long desired the position of CEO of Jabot. Unfortunately, his mother knocked him down a few rungs on her journey up the corporate ladder, landing the comfortable position and appointing her son as COO of the company. Kyle has been desperately trying to disguise the fact that his mother is his boss, which has irritated him. As a result, the two have had several disagreements in recent weeks, despite attempting to collaborate. 
However, a narrative twist could have Kyle unexpectedly stepping into his father's footsteps sooner than he realizes. The young and the restless spoilers, Jack Abbott lands in the hospital, trying to help Nikki Newman. According to YNR spoilers, Jack Abbott, Peter Bergman, recently relapsed while attempting to help Nick Newman, Melody Thomas Scott, recover from a drinking binge. He begged and pleaded with her to get sober, but she refused. Taking extreme measures, he adopted the if you can't be them, join them mentality and fell hard off the wagon of his pill-popping addiction. He took several tablets and mixed them with wine. Jack passed out during the end of the May 2nd show, and there is a significant likelihood he will be sent to the hospital. Regardless of how long he stays in the hospital, he may need to take the appropriate step and go to treatment in light of this occurrence. YNR spoilers, could Kyle Abbott be hastily promoted? If Jack takes time off from Jabot, it will be all hands on deck at the company. Diane cannot handle the company alone, so Kyle's parents may offer him a co-CEO position. Will Diane and Kyle still be able to work together? It's one thing to take orders from your mother at work, and another to collaborate on ideas as two equal-level executives. With that stated, given Kyle and Diane's recent spats, there's a significant chance the metaphorical feces will hit the fan between the mother and son if a company crisis occurs. Mamie's bomb, Diane's rage, Jack's loss, Nate and Audra's meeting. The young and the restless spoilers for the week of May 6, 2024 show that a new preview clip has been published. It depicts Mamie Johnson, Veronica Red, nervously preparing to blow a bombshell on the team at Chancellor Winters. Diane Jenkins Abbott, Susan Walters, lashes out at Jack Abbott, Peter Bergman, who claims he did nothing wrong. Nate Hastings, Sean Dominic, and Audra Charles, Zuleika Silver, have a meeting. Victor Newman, Eric Braden, questions Cole Howard, J. Eddie Peck. The Young and the Restless Video Preview, Diane Jenkins Abbott's Rage. YNR teasers for the week of May 6 state that the preview clip shows Jack returning home to Diane after collapsing at Nikki Newman's, Melody Thomas Scott, suite at GCAC. Diane blows up at her husband. Diane can't believe Jack gave up years of sobriety for Nikki. That is when Jack asserts that his sobriety is not jeopardized. Diane doesn't believe Jack and wonders how she knows he doesn't have medications on him right now. YNR spoilers, Jack Abbott's loss. Jack opens his mouth in response to Diane's honest question. Jack appears perplexed and surprised when Diane questions his sobriety. However, following Jack's daring action to assist Nikki, everyone should be asking these questions. Jack will most likely lose his ability to sponsor Nikki. If AA does not do it, Victor will. Also, may Jack lose his marriage? What about his employment at Jabot? Jack may be the CEO, but they also have a board. Could Kyle Abbott, Michael Mueller, seize this opportunity to secure the role for himself? Perhaps Diane will fill the role, putting Jack out cold. The Young and the Restless Video Preview, Mamie Johnson's Business Bombshell The Young and the Restless Spoilers for the week of May 6 state that the video preview also features Mamie at Chancellor Winters. Mamie occupies herself by sorting through heaps of paper with her back to Lily Winters, Crystal Khalil. Lily appears perplexed and concerned. Then Lily asks Mamie what the purpose of this gathering is. Mamie anxiously stalls before saying she'd prefer wait until everyone arrives. Mamie adds that she guarantees it will be worth it. YNR spoilers, week of May 6, 2024, Nate tells Audra he thinks they're buddies. Nate continues, friends tell the truth. Nate pronounces, truth, with great emphasis. Audra does not appear pleased or amused. Audra inquires, are you sure that's all it is, Nate? Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any future updates.